Today, the primary section of the Aga Khan schools has been a swarm of activity as students and pupils competed in entrepreneurial skills in an entrepreneurial grandhouse competition and exhibition. The competition by the Aga Khan Education Services saw learners show off the skills acquired while starting up different business ventures. Some of these business ventures included farming, cooking, baking and innovation, among others. But most importantly, students were also required to show how to run these business ideas with the aim of making them profitable. Some of the students we interacted with illustrated how they came up with the different ideas and how they implemented them. We made a soap called Tibro Soap from our chemistry lab and we're here to showcase on how exactly we made it. We made some doughnuts, some, our doughnut there, which is for 55000 Normally how we make cakes, um, they, they don't have eggs and milk but they have oil and water. Fred Tukahiro, the principal of the National Section of the Education Services, observes that this activity is intended to foster an entrepreneurial way of thinking among young people. If we are able to really inspire these children to become entrepreneurs at a very young age, over time, then they will be able to have actually become better thinkers, better creative sovereign pro uh, problem solvers. Principal Tukahiro, our father, observes that it will help to create more job creators instead of job seekers, which has created a challenge of unemployment in the country. We don't want to teach children who will join that group and actually add up to the number. We would rather we start working with these children at a very young age so that they start thinking entrepreneurship rather than thinking that they will look for a job. At the end of the competitions, students with the most outstanding ideas were rewarded with various gifts. Joyce Nakato, NTV Weekend Edition.